Good morning. Wildfires are raging across the American West. More than 70 burning in 11 states. It's said to be the worst fire season in a half century. But the cavalry's coming. Reinforcements, including the U.S. Marines, arrive on the front lines today, Saturday, August 5th, 2000. From NBC News, this is Today with Soledad O'Brien and David Bloom. Live from Studio 1A in Rockefeller Plaza. Welcome to today. I'm David Bloom. And I'm Soledad O'Brien. Now, fire crews, of course, are working around the clock, but many people say it could be till October or November before these fires are actually under control. And hundreds of people already forced out of their homes. Also, this morning, the federal government is investigating whether some of the most popular tires in America are, in fact, too dangerous to be on the road. The company involved says, no, they're safe. But now, one of the biggest tire retailers in the country is halting sales. We'll explain. And the governor's mansion in Arkansas is due for a facelift. So Governor Mike Huckabee and his wife are moving into their backyard into what many describe as a triple-wide trailer. It's also a target for jokes and criticism. Some say it reinforces stereotypes. We're going to be talking to Arkansas's first family this morning. Target of jokes? Never. Not at all. A new and controversial look is coming to Olympic swimming in the form of high-tech swimsuits. We'll tell you all about that. And we'll have advice on something that most dads don't even want to think about, helping their little girl buy her first bra. Not we'll have advice. Yet. Yeah, you're not. Thankful. Not yet. <laughs> we'll have advice for moms and dads and daughters as well. And actress Polly Draper will drop by to talk about her new film. And also actor Kevin Bacon will drop by to talk about his new film. There you go. And Broadway's back on the plaza. We had a change in our schedule and we're excited about it. The cast of Rent is here. I have seen that They'll five times now. <laughs> <laughs> right, they'll perform live on our plaza the sixth time for Solid Out. <laughs> Not ahead this morning. Before we get to any of it, however, let's get caught up on the morning news with NBC's Frederica Whitfield, who's sitting in at the news desk this morning. Good morning to you, Fred. Always nice to see you. Good morning, Soledad and David. Good morning, everyone. Mesa Verde National Park in Colorado is closed again because a new wildfire is threatening it.